During the month of Kartik, I keep an ancient notebook. It looks as if it comes directly from a market in Morocco. And uh, make entries into the notebook. Uh, uh, today I made this entry. Mm, it's about the minds, the mind of Radha. The mind of Radha is like a moon. Mm, and she turns Krishna into a deer that builds a mark on the moon of her mind. Maybe you know the moon is called Shashanka in Sanskrit, marked with the form of the deer. When the moon is uh, fully shining, a full moon, um, this shape can be seen. You see a distinct deer with its raised ears. This is the image which Rupa Goswami uh, has about uh, uh, Radha's mind. The mind is like a moon and Krishna is always in there. And this Krishna has raised his attention uh, uh, to Radha. She's always, um, um, Radha is always so absorbed in him. Um, there's an ancient verse, uh, Ponamasi speaks to Nandi Muki. Oh look, how amazing! The great sages and yogis try to withdraw their minds from the sense objects of this world. And they are happy if they are successful for even a moment. Just so that they can think of Krishna. But this girl Radha thinks so much of Krishna that there is nothing and no one else in her mind at any moment of the day. And she sometimes performs great austerities to have a little space for other things. In this way, she tries to forget Krishna, whom the yogis always want to remember. This is the beauty of the month of Kartik, as we experience it here in Vindavan. Everyone is remembering Krishna. Everyone is uh, thinking of Krishna. Even if we go on the vegetable market, and everyone joyfully greets us, uh, Hare Krishna. Of course, sometimes they, they want to get an extra good price when they say Hare Krishna. But at least uh, there's Krishna in all the dealings. Um, you know, when we go to the uh, places like Vrindakun, for instance, we see devotees coming from the villages to sit down at the sacred space to uh, have darshan of the deities, chant the mantra, the, and then eat prasadam, and everyone is welcome. Uh, I saw a scene where two men were just discussing, two villagers, and they were eating, and then there were four dogs around them, and they threw them chapatis, so that even the dogs could celebrate and be joyous and free of anxiety in the month of Kartik. The mind, the mind, the mind needs to be freed. The mind needs to be clear and transparent so that also one day Radha and Krishna can appear there like the rising sun and the rising moon. Let us now again become mindful. For a moment let us take a few deep breaths and focus our attention on Shimati Radharani who has a mind like the moon who is marked totally with the form of Krishna.